What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be comparing the Spitfire four blade prop to the Black Max three blade prop of the exact same pitches. We're going to do first do a visual inspection, uh, see what, see if there's anything visually we notice that's different. And then finally we're going to put some pen to paper and what Mercury tells us versus what I've experienced. Okay, so visually, I see that the Spitfire here has four blades, one, two, three, four, and you know, it has this nice little Spitfire impression, impression on the edge, on the side of it. They're both 14 pitches, so we got four blades here, the three blade Black Max. Um, I noticed on the inside, slightly difference between the two. Um, it has a support in four places on the Spitfire. Uh, they line up perfectly with the props or the blades on the prop. And the same thing on the Black Max except for there's three and it lines up with the center of the blade as well. I'm looking straight down the prop. I'm looking at the space between this blade and the start of this one end of this one, the start of this one, and then I'll look at it here for the Black Max. They don't appear to be that much difference in the spacing. What I'm noticing mostly is the blade size is a lot different. I mean, I think you guys can see that these blades are a lot smaller than these blades. Um, so I think they have the same coverage but their performance is completely different they're the exact same pitch um, and i've operated both of these obviously this one's a little older than this one uh, it's had a few better days but i've used them both pretty well um, just to put some pen to paper here boy that's gonna be tough to do guys uh, so, number of blades, obviously the Spitfire has four, Black Max has three. The diameter is actually different, um, even though it's really hard to see uh, the difference in the diameter. I think that's because of just that, that small difference here. Um, the Black Max does have a little larger diameter. Um, I have been told that that attributes to a little slower acceleration of the, of the spin up of the prop versus a uh, smaller diameter prop, which kind of makes sense to me. They're both 14 pitches. Um, what I've experienced at wide open throttle is I can get 5,800 RPMs with the Spitfire. Uh, at the same pitch as uh, the Black Max, I can hit 6,000 RPMs. This is the exact same boat loading, myself by myself and everything. Uh, same fuel amount. So th these two comparisons are done probably like one weekend apart. Um, the max speed I can get with a Spitfire is 31. The max speed I can get with a Black Max was 35, and that is on my GPS. Now, it comes down to the butt dyno. What, which one do I prefer? Well, I like the Spitfire. I'm sacrificing a little bit of speed so I can get up on plane a little faster, um, which is kind of important when you're trying to get out of dodge um like waves are starting to come in hey i need to i need to move i need to get out of here uh so it gets up on plane a little faster um it doesn't bog on the motor as hard um it does sacrifice a little top speed but i'm okay with that uh considering i have a 60 horse mercury um i knew i wasn't going for speed um the other piece that i like about the spitfire is when I am turning, I can turn sharper at full throttle than I can with the Black Max without blowing out the prop. Uh, what I mean by blowing out the prop is where the RPMs just skyrocket and you actually lose grab with your uh, prop and you're just cavitating. So that is a huge benefit of the Spitfire. Um, no, the last thing is, is when I'm going over waves, um, I do live in the Pandandle of Texas, 
and the waves do get pretty crazy uh, on the lakes at times. And when I need to travel across the lake to get home or get to my spot, uh, the waves do beat up on you a little, little bit. And the Spitfire does stay hooked up. It, it will not, if, if you trim it down just a little bit, just as much as you would with the Black Max, it won't give out. It'll, it'll stay hooked up, it'll keep you going, and you won't have to restart in the middle of the lake. So hopefully um, this will convince you to get a Spitfire. Um, if it doesn't, let me know in the comments below and I will, I'll do some on the water testing if you like. But today uh, we're just doing this visual comparison and my, my personal experience with this. And you notice that I still have the Black Max. Um, you never know. Um, I always like to have a, I don't have a spare prop for my trolling motor. Yeah, if my, I break a blade off my trolling motor, well, my fishing day is pretty much shot, and I get to go home. Um, you break a, break a blade off your outboard, uh, your day is more than just shot. You're going to have a hard time getting home without a tow. So uh, I'm really glad to do have a spare now, and it's a little bit of a pain uh, probably to change them out if I'm on the water, but uh, I'm sure I could figure out a way to do it to get home. And if you haven't already, uh, please subscribe to my channel. These, uh, these poor props would love to see you subscribe to my channel. And uh, I'll be doing more videos like this, uh, comparing things and reviews and showing you guys what I've, all I've done. So until next time, get out there and go catch you some fish.